Hi everybody, <laughs> it's me again. I had a niche. But um, yeah, welcome back to my channel. And for those of you who don't know, I'm Tina. Hi! Um, today we are going to do a little DIY of another little fairy garden. Now I had al I have already put the fairy garden together, but I was just didn't want to be on camera because you know my hair wasn't done. I didn't have no makeup on. You know, I look like I look bad. So yeah, I just filmed the uh, making of the the little fairy garden. It's right over there. I'm looking at it, but yeah. So um, so I'm just gonna edit it together with this intro, and then for the out, I'll make an outro as well to um, tack onto it as well. But um, yeah, let's just get right into that. Um, so here comes the DIY. <laughs> here it comes. <laughs> Let's get into it. Yeah, um, yeah, I got this um, flower pot, and it's just a poinsettia. I bought it for a Christmas decoration, but yeah, I'm, Christmas is over, so I want to just take the flowers out. And I'll probably keep the styrofoam, if possible. Yeah, just make a little mess, but it's okay. Make a star foam mess. Yeah, I don't need these flowers. I can buy tons of flowers at the dollar store. So they can go in the garbage. Yeah, I'm gonna have to sweep again. <laughs> I had to sweep up that stuff foam. Now I want the um I want this to go down. Let's see if I can get to go all the way down. throw this. There's some sand in the bottom of it, which I don't need. So. And I want this thing that's better. Just a little better. I want it to be flush. Stay in there. I might have to cut a little bit off the bottom. It's got like that little divot thingy in there. Yeah, I'm just gonna take my scissors. Just cut a little bit off. Just a little bit. Make some more styrofoam mess. I'm good at that. There we go. There we go. Perfect. I have a garbage bag right next to me. But I knew I'd be making a mess. And I sure am. I was right about that. So, let's get this off the table. Well, I got that done. It helps if I plug in my... Um... That thing... <laughs> Oops, if I plug that in. So we're going to plug that in. I'm going to take this purple ribbon, or pink ribbon, rather. I want this pink ribbon. I intend to use it to make something out of to show you. Pretty pink ribbon. There's a lot more here than I thought. That's okay. We're just going to cut some off. We'll just cut some off and fold it. And fold it. Yeah. 
and we're going to just take it. You know, these are all just ideas off the top of my head, so if it doesn't work, then you're going to see firsthand a fail. <laughs> and I will just try again for something different. But what I'm going to try to do is just roll this baby up. I'm going to just roll, roll, roll very carefully. I'm going to try to keep it uniform or flat on the ends or whatever you would call that. Keep it flat on the ends. Yeah. It's semi flat. It be semi flat. Now it would help if I had my glue gun, <laughs> but I forgot to plug it in. We're gonna take some more ribbon though, and I want this to be a little bit bigger. That's what it is right now. I want it to be a little bit bigger. So we're gonna hold this in half again. And we're going to just roll this right up in it. Try to. We're going to try and roll it up some more. Try to get it to be flat on the ends. And it quite work. Okay, let's try this. if I can flatten it out as I'm going. I mean, nothing has to be perfect. As I'm always saying in my videos. Nope, it don't have to be perfect. There, I think that's perfect. <laughs> that is perfect. Okay, we're going to need to glue that little piece down, well, two little pieces down. So, I just got to wait for the glue gun to heat up. I highly doubt it's ready yet. It might be. Maybe I'll get a little bit out of it. Hopefully I don't burn myself in the process. Because this is very sheer ribbon, so it's, that glue will probably go right through it. So I'm just going to try to be very careful. Oh, it's not too bad. Oh, just dropped the salt shaker. There. I think I like it on this side with the white on top. Yeah. I'm probably going to add more glue to that. Because I need that to stay. I need it to stay. I'm just going to put a little bit of glue. I don't have anything to use. I'll just use my scissors. Just kind of smear it on there. There. Put it down. Get off of my thinner. And then get it off my scissors before it completely dries. There we go. Okay. Yep, that's pretty much what I wanted. And I want to make another one. Which I will, I'll just use some of this ribbon with it because I want them different colors. And 
This one happens to be right next to me. So I'm going to do the same thing with this ribbon. And I'm going to bend it in half. Bend it in half a couple times. Just like that. And we're going to roll her out up. As tightly as you can get it. Try to keep them... Try to keep the strands as straight as possible. And we're rolling, 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 rolling. All those strands are swollen. Keep them doggies rolling raw high. And through the rain and weather, I don't remember the words. Wishing my girl was by my side. That yeah, has a nice little one. And get that hot glue gun again. For the big old dollop. <clears throat> a dollop of Daisy. Hot. Hot tamale. Hot tamale. Rolling, rolling, rolling. Though the streams are swollen, keep them doggies rolling raw eyes. Now that just sounds evil. <laughs> evil raw hide. I'm just putting it right on that rim. I just kind of put it on that rim and I'm going to let it dry like that. Mm -hmm. yeah, I touched it and it was hot. I touched it and it was hot. Oops, almost dropped it. He has a little bit of... <laughs> I keep dropping it. It scares me. I'm like, oh my goodness, I dropped it. Oh my goodness. Oh well. That'll be fine. I don't think it's going to come off. I don't think it's going to come off. That seems good. That seems good. And it's okay if there's going to be different sizes because that's what I want. That's what we got so far. And I know you're what you're thinking. Like, Tina, what are you doing? What are you doing? Well, you'll find out in a moment. I don't even know what I'm doing. <laughs> We'll find out if my... I have an idea. We'll see if it works. But I need to get some more ribbon. I might have some in here. Let me see. I might have some in here. I might have some in here. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, oh, I got this ribbon. I forgot about that ribbon. Got this ribbon. I do one in that ribbon. I haven't even opened it yet. I got this at the dollar store. And we're gonna take a smaller one out because I want a smaller cylinder. And I'll we'll just we're just gonna fold it in half. And then fold it in half again. And then we're going to roll it on up. Yeah. We're going to just bend that under because it's a little too short. There. And, oops, there. I'm going to just put some glue on that. Big old dollop. I didn't mean to use that much, but that's okay. And carefully not poke my finger in it, which I just did. That's okay. That's okay. That'd be okay. 
<laughs> yeah, it's hot. Ow, 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 ow. <laughs> ow. It'd be hot. Yeah, I put some more on. It's not quite grouped up like it was last time. I'll put a little bit on this one. This one's not quite as tight as the other ones. Because I kept burning myself. That's okay. It'd be okay. Okay, it's not hot anymore. It's tacky, but not hot. I'm just going to use that to kind of hold down those sides. Trying to get it off my finger. There we go. There. That's good. That's go. That's okay. It's okay. I have three different. I got that. I have three of them. I think I'll stick with three. Now it's going to be the moment of truth if my your idea pans out. I'm looking down below again because that's where my stuff is still. Okay. Get some flowers. We got some flowers. And we're going to need to cut off. I'm just going to cut off three of those. I, don't, I doubt I'll be able to use all of them, but... And we're going to need three of these. And then three of the dark purple ones. There. Get on there. Stay on the table. I'm going to throw those over there for now. Yeah, there. Come back to me. Come back. Let's um, move this stuff down a little bit. There we go. Yeah, my camera is not quite. There, how's that? Is that better? Okay, we're going to take one of these, and we're going to just push it down in here. But I think it's going to need to be much smaller. It's going to need to be much smaller, which I figured. So we're going to take it right up in here and cut it off. So we'll take some glue. I'm just gonna squeeze a little bit in there. Hopefully some went in. <laughs> I don't know. I'm guessing it did. A little, a little tiny flower pot. Okay, put that to the side and let that dry. Now this one, we're going to need to make a little bit of room in the middle. So I'm just kind of squishing it with a pair of scissors to open it up a little bit. Let's open it up. I want to be able to add more than one flower to this big one. And of course the bottom is going to poke out, and that's fine. We're just going to stretch her out. You don't need to put much of the stem down in there. I want to put a little bit <clears throat> of each color down in there. Just cut off a little bit of that one. And I'll cut off a little bit. I'll cut off a little bit more of this one. See if I can. I'll cut it off here and maybe take some of the 
the flowers off it. Like, just pull the flowers off it. Like that. Pull down like that bunch there. Yeah, so now you got flower. And then I want a pink one. I'll just cut it off about right here. And I'll probably have to pull some of these off. This is enough to give me some stem. And then I'm just gonna poke them in here. It'll look something like that once it's glued. So we're gonna glue those in. I'm gonna try to open it up a little bit more. A little bit more. Okay, some glue in there, hopefully some glue went in, <laughs> and I'm just going to put it in, put it in, put it in, that one, and that one, there. Isn't that cute? Little flower pot. And then we got this one. And this one I want to try and put two in. So we're just going to open it up a little bit. There. We're going to put in one of these ones. I'm going to cut it down a little bit further. And go with a pink one. And I'm just going to pull some of these off. So let's do that. <clears throat> okay. And I'll do the same on this one. There. And I'm just going to put some glue in that. those in just like that uh -oh. yeah, I probably should have got a better flower than that one but it's too late now because it's glued in that's fine that be totally fine okay now that's the easy part <coughs> Throwing out the moss again, and we are going to do some mossing. That's what we do. Well, first, we're going to do is we're going to glue these flower pots pretty much to the side of this thing, like right there. Can you see it? We're going to glue it just like that. So, let's do that. I'm going to make sure I put the, the glue sections in the back. I'm just going to turn it on its side because it will be easier. I'm just rolling it around in it a little bit to get it adhered very well. And I'll just glue these in like I said I was going to and I'll show you. And then the last one. going to add moss to this and I'm going to glue it in. So I'm just going to throw some glue down into the into the styrofoam thing and it's going to melt so I need to be fast. I need to be fast. Ow, it hurt. Let's try to stop burning yourself, Tina.
Now I'm just putting it on top of the other moss to kind of build it up a little bit. see the bottom of those pots so very carefully putting it up around those pots very carefully try not to touch the glue already burnt myself once <laughs> already burned myself there. You can need a little bit over on this side. But that's going to fall out. Okay. That's what it looks like so far. I'm sorry you couldn't, you didn't see it. I just, all I did was just put the moss in. That'd be all I did. And I made a mess on my table, like I always do. I'm just going to clean up as much of this moss as I can and put it back in the bag. I'm going to throw this down here. And I'm going to just wipe this off a little bit. And throw that in the garbage. Okay, now I'm looking... Looking in my box here for for my little angel or fairy. Right there she is. I was looking for my little fairy that I had left over from my other craft. I wanted to use her, and I'm looking. She has a little thing of a bobby to sit on, like that. Well, this one's not as good as the other one. Oh, she still has glue on her butt. Yeah, I tried putting her down on glue with glue last time, and it did not hold. But I'm gonna try again. I'll try again. If at first you don't succeed, <clears throat> if at first you don't succeed, try, try again. And put your my nails again, trying to get this glue off. Oh, well, there we go. Yeah, she'll sit just like that. Yeah, I don't know what happened to the purple flower I had. But, oh, well. Not a big deal. I'm just going to Put a big old flop on there. And just shove her in it. Just let her sit a minute. I'm looking for, um, there it is. I found it. I found it. Yeah. I had an idea, but that will be too big. That's okay. That's okay. I just add the fairy in like that. I'm just gonna put a whole bunch of glue here and just shove her right on top of that. Yeah, it's nothing spectacular like the, my fairy garden, but yeah, isn't that cute? This little flower garden. Well, maybe I could take some of these. And 
I got some idea. Oh, that was mine. I got me an idea. I'll take that off. Should I have some flowers around her? It looks like she picked them. I think that looks cute. I'll just take a few. Put them around her. I'm just poking them in there. I'll put one over here behind her. And then add a little pink one in. Oh, I already got that one. That's this one I don't have. It is this one that is lacking from the garden. Not. Oh no, okay. They're just so close in color, I couldn't tell. So close. But not quite. There. That right there next to her. There we go. I think that's perfect. Just a little fairy in her garden. Picking flowers and putting them in her flower pots. I'm actually, um, I'm not sure if I'm going to. It's just an idea. Just an idea. But we're going to try this. Yeah, the flower pot's a little dirty, but that's okay. I can wash that off. It's not a big deal. I'll pull it up. And then get it pulled up. Now it's going to tie the bow. I'm going to try and tie the bow. Going to try. That might not have cut enough ribbon. Well, I cut enough ribbon, but I might not have cut it right. <laughs> or tied it right. Yeah, it's just sliding down. Oh well, I'm not gonna go to the trouble of gluing it on. But here she is again. There's another little fairy garden with her little flower pots. I think she turned out darling. Okay, well that's it. <laughs> I just waited like 10 seconds and started the outro. But yeah, that's it. So here's the little yeah, I have it right here. Here she is. Isn't she cute? Isn't she darling? Yeah. Cute little, th very easy. I mean, everything I got at the dollar store, except for the fairy. I got that off collections, etc. But they don't sell it anymore, sadly. But I did look on Wish, and they have tons of fairies you can buy for very cheap prices. They even had them for $2. You know, the $2 store. But yeah, you can find fairies on there. So, so it's very, it's very cheap thing to make. I got this pot. It was um, during Christmas time, and the pot's filthy. <laughs> yeah, I need to wash it off. But yeah, I think she turned out even cuter than my little um, than my little clothes hanger one. Yeah, I think she turned out even cuter. I might have to redo that one. Pull out the white flowers, put some colored flowers in it. It just needs something. It's missing something. I'm not sure, but I'll figure it out. Maybe I'll do another DIY on how to make that look cuter. <laughs> but yeah, this is this one. So cute. I have her on my windowsill. Yeah. Yeah, this one was on this base. 
but it the hot glue didn't hold it so but I'm thinking I'm just gonna strip it all up down and restart it so check I mean I probably and I'll probably film it yeah redo it and film it and make it look cuter that's the plan I'm just not happy with how it turned out I mean it's cute enough but yeah she's falling her she came on dead I haven't hot glued her back in yet but um yeah, and her little leg is broken. It's been broken. But she's hid it inside the um, the water bucket. So you can't really tell. But anyways, that's it. That's my DIY of my little fairy garden. The little... Um, I was trying to give the um, the impression that she was picking flowers. And putting them in a little the little flower pot she found lying around. Her being a fairy, she needs something small. So, you know, it's like, oh, she just took some ribbon and rolled it up and turned it into a flower pot. That's... That was the impression I was trying to give, but I think it is darling. But, yep, that's it. So don't forget, like, comment, subscribe, and share. And right here you'll be seeing my picture, so click on it. <coughs> click on it. You don't want to miss out. I'll be posting new videos every day. So until next time, bye.